Brooklyn at the House of Vans, having an art show. Painted some ramps. Some dudes are gonna skate. Should be fun. Everything we did uh, out in the uh, installation area, there's a bunch of stuff I'm surprising out there for sure. We had four days to paint, like, I don't know how many, four or 5,000 square feet of wall. There's a lot of paint out there. Just uh, framing up my stuff. Uh, final few hours left. Kind of going for a, a ghetto paradise. Pretty much grew up skateboarding. Uh, started in uh, middle school and uh, skated every day. My dad made me my first skateboard when I was five. It's a long time ago. I had a um, shop board, this, this skateboard store called Lickety Sticks in my neighborhood, and I uh, had ACS 500 trucks and actually had Vans wheels when they made skateboard wheels, just red and blue wheels, so that was my first setup. Growing up skating, I always wore Vans. Even when I was younger, I would go to the skate shop and be like, I'm gonna get the sickest new uh, Etnies or the sickest new, you know, Airwalks. Be like get the tricked out ones. I'd get there and I'd always just go for like classic bands, high tops, or the like simple low tops, like Ian McKay style. Could never jump into like the fancy shoes. I like them simple. Everyone's expecting an art show, which this is a typical art show that we're sitting in all this stuff right now. And then uh, all that's going to be surprised. I think pe some people know that there's a there's an installation out there, but I don't think people really know to what extent 